Alright, you guys. Here we are. Shin Megami Tensei 5. Vengeance. And we are just kind of continuing forward after defeating Fion Makumul last time. I don't know how he comes to that name when his name sounds like Mac and Come. Seducing humans was supposed to be my job until those damn Kadishtu butted in. I wish something would be done about them already. She's not having it with the female competition. She's not a girl's girl, as the kids say. Girl's girl has really taken on a spot in culture as of late, hasn't it? There's a fucking ley line. Oh, not ley line, I'm sorry. There's a fucking uh, abscess. I think that's the first thing we should tackle today, is getting to that abscess and then destroying that abscess. How y'all doing? It is a Monday. No, it's not. <laughs> that is a lie. It is a Wednesday at fucking 9 something p.m. 9.15 p.m. And, oh look, it's, it's Pixcasa. Could we have to not fight him? We are just running around. Oh, Pixcasa's essence. Oh god. Oh no. He's fully blocking the entryway. I have to like... No, 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 no. Okay. But yeah, we are mostly just running around right now, exploring, so... Be patient with me while I find fun things. Oh shit, what do you think you want to learn? Seal to one. I don't know what seal does. Status afflictions still are not super real to me, I hate to say. So to ensure, what's he giving me? All right. Everybody, come on. Eight, leveling them all up. I don't care about all this. What's blinding strike? It's not that deep. Oh, what'd he learn? I like him. Let's put him back on the team as well. Um, Nellify is a force attack against all allies at once. I would like to do that because at some point I'm going to wish I had that. She doesn't need to counter. Actually, she doesn't need to have boot. Yeah, she does. We need to go talk to the um the rabbit now that we found Chetsai. What does he want to learn? Hama on. Why is my controller Okay. Heavy light attack. We need that! We need that shit. We ain't got an area heavy light skill on the team. Um Matsio, who needs it? Get it out of here. Hama on. Hama on, hama off. Hama oh my god Leave it to a horse. Of course, of course. Should I kill them or should I run? You're right, I should run. We have better things to do. Like put Copa Popa Whoa. Like put Copa Tengu on the team. In place of Aerithus. Shiki Ouija, I'm gonna be so fucking real with you. You can stay. I like you. Very cool guy. And we are trying to get to the abscess, but also just generally explore. Lots to see, Mimon to find. I'm quite happy still to have Agathion here running around with me. And I'm not feeling particularly wordy tonight, so. Don't know what to tell you. Not in a bad mood or anything, I'm just like, 
Not a lot of words. I just took a bath. Earlier today, I straightened and waved my hair. And you might say, it looks exactly the same as it did. No, you don't understand. It doesn't feel the same as it did. Because when I don't straighten and wave my hair, just leaving it in its natural state, it is so sus- Oh no, I remember him. He's mean. He's the horse with the groin. He's a very mean horse in a parking garage. <laughs> he wants me dead. And you know what? You know what? We should kill him. I could just run from him. I really could. He's really easy enough to run from. There's also somebody that has a mission for me over there. I don't know how to get to him. Maybe it's through the parking garage. What have you found? But yeah, the hair feels way different. So now that it's co coated in silicones and straightened and waved, it feels just a lot better for me. Especially because it has been a humid summer in Missouri. Oh, God. What's his name? I forget his name. Should I fight him? His name's Arobus. And um, we'll think about if I should fight him up here. But um, it has been a hot, humid summer. We had a week. It was like in the hundreds hundreds wet humid hundreds in missouri that's not right you guys and then we had a week where it was like 70s and it was so beautiful and then back to the 90s back to the hundreds it's been whoa they are just fly, floating out of the ground where are they going what are you two doing mischievous but um where's it going with this just my hair feels better was it worth sitting in front of a mirror for an hour luckily I have really good AC in this room so like I can use hot tools in front of a mirror and not completely fucking melt any other room in the house would be a nightmare I burnt my thumb can't use a curling iron without burning yourself it's like God's trade it's like I gave you tools to defy the natural things I gave you which my hair is a wig I truly am defying God in many, many ways. For me to glue a wig onto my head, defiant. And then for me to take the natural texture of that hair that I didn't even grow myself, and then straighten it, defiant. And then the fucking defiant cherry on top, the maraschino cherry of defiance. They dye those fuckers red, bitch. Um, the maraschino cherry of defiance is the fact that after straightening hair that's not mine into a texture of straight, that is not natural to it, I then wave it back to a very similar texture to its natural texture. Ain't that, how am I supposed to get across here? Ain't that fucking something. And you know what? God tries me. God tries me every fucking day. And that's me trying him back. Deal with it. And I don't say that to be like, haha, fuck God. Me and God are on good terms. We like one another. Oh. I quite like God, but we are equals. Is that a crazy thing to say? And I don't mean that in a narcissistic way of like, ha, I'm like God. No, no, no. I mean, we're all like, what if God was one of us? You know what I'm saying? Just a stranger on the bus. And I think God is one of us. I think we are all in our own little way. Gods of our own. I talked about this in a Here's of the Kingdom video. The title of the video is in our creativity and in our creation, we are all cruel gods of our own. That is dead ass the title of that video. So if you want to know how I feel about that, it's like tucked in that hour and a half long video. I got 60 glory, good, because I need it. Um, And I know there's glory me Thomas floating all around the map, so how badly do I really need it? But I don't feel like killing them at the moment. Where, where am I getting to? I got to the top of the parking garage and then for, I mean, I could jump down there. I feel like there's there's a meme on over there. There is a parking structure in downtown Columbia, Missouri. I love talking to y'all about Columbia, Missouri. Like, <laughs> come visit. <laughs> it's nice. I like it. I don't know if it'd be fun for visiting, but it's fun for living, bitch. Let's go get that meme on. Then we'll get the abscess. Sorry, I'm just running in circles. Um, my sense of direction is absolutely cooked. Like, I don't even know where I saw that meme on anymore. I want to go get that thing over there. Where? <laughs> Where'd the meme on go? Hello? 
you guys. Ah. Mimon. Show your wisdom with me. Rooftop is nice and all, but no allowed up there at school. What? Why I say that? I deeply, deeply believe that the Mimon are humans. And again, I don't remember if that's something I came up with on my own, or if one of them told me that at some point in a previous playthrough of this game. But I think they used to be people, so when they're like, why did I talk about school? I think that's your past life speaking through you. Now, I don't know if I'll get that yellow thing, but I believe that's the floor with the aerobus, and I needn't... Let's see if I can get in there. Nope, not even close. I'm a fool. <gasps> Oh, chickens, chickens, chickens. Oh my god. Should I kill chickens? No. That's a lot of Copa Tango. Hello. I like all you guys' pants and costumes. Um, I do have to go. Because I'm looking to whoop, chill today and mostly just do fights that I have to do. Now, if I remember correctly, those are fire demons. I hope none of us are weak to fire. I do not know off the top of my head. As fire demons... Do you think they're weak to Bufu? Might as well use a stone for it. A shard. Hit them all. They are not weak to ice. Alright, how about force? No. How about... Light. I feel like they'll be weak to light because look how fucking dark sided they are. Yeah, y'all hated that shit. Y'all hate the light. Um, I would use a light shard. Hit them all, hit them all, hit them all. Not ice shard, brother. Light shard. You know what? We just. Somebody just learned a heavy light attack don't remember who it was but I would like to use that well, that's kind of cool what's whispering order large recovery to self above max HP adds one press turn to the next icon how does one use that I don't know um I'm gonna just go crazy with physical move Somebody weak to dark? I think I'm weak to dark. No, I resist that shit. Okay, we all three resist dark. The darkness is not. Ooh. Okay, that's not good. Um, who died? Copa Tango. Cheeky Ouija's made out of paper, and even he didn't die to the fire. What's wrong with you, Copa Tango? It's getting really hard to keep you around. I should have used the Magatsuhi. Uh critical thing. Let's bring in the person that learned the the powerful Hamas. I think it was Shitsai, wasn't it? Come on out, big ol' fucking sheep boy! Let's go. Quite like you as well. Now one of y'all's about to get absolutely fucking destroyed. He's dying. Maybe I should heal the- Ooh. I don't have time to heal the girls. You wanna- I didn't save! Oh! God! I didn't save recently! I gotta run past the horse in the parking structure again! The groin horse. Y'all didn't really see him up close because I was actively running away from him in his terror because he's a blight. But he's got whole groin out. He's got pelvic bones aplenty. Man, oh, that's a cute little guy. I'm a bee. I'm a bee. I'm a bee. Japanese yokai from the... Alright, well. Fuck me! We are really back. Oh, no! Now, everybody's weak. Hello, hello. Hello, I know. We Now we haven't talked to you. Oh my god. What a setback because I chose to be foolish and not safe. My friend Holden, the one I bought this game for, who's been really, really enjoying it. 
he had a really rough go at the beginning, and he plays harder games. It's not because it's hard. Um, well, he did die in the tutorial, which I didn't even know you could do. You know that tutorial where you touch hands with Algami and then you fight three Daemon? Um, he died in that tutorial. He was trying to conserve MP. He was using a late game version of intelligence and the game didn't expect it. And he died in the tutorial and I was like, oh no. But he kept just like not saving, which is crazy because you can save any time Anytime, any place in the thunder and rain, stare into your eyes. I can feel the rain. You know that song? It's called Anytime, Any Place, Anytime, Anywhere. Janet Nicole Jackson. Shit. We are too weak for. Am I about to get bodied again by moths? I can't do this right now. I'm so sorry. No disrespect. I just. I must be on my way, you guys. That was a shocker, but... Okay. Now, everything I explored and found... I'm not gonna spend the time to explore and... Oh my god, look at that beautiful woman with swords! Um, please don't castrate me, ma'am. I have... Never mind, I don't want to talk about things I've jerked off to in this life. It doesn't matter. It's been a lot of things, though. But also, to live within modernity... Please don't get me, please don't get me. To live within modernity and to not exhaust the, like, exhausted who amount of things to jerk off to, I think, is, again, kind of taunting God. It's rude. God gave you a cornucopia of sexual pleasure type things. And don't be addicted to porn. Don't have that dopamine addiction, you know. I do think I have a dopamine addiction. I'm actually actively looking to tackle it lately. Because the way it manifests is sometimes actually very harmful. And sometimes it's like tiny harmful, but sometimes it's big harmful. And I'm working to work with that. And I don't think I can necessarily completely drive away the impulse for um, dopamine. Because one, we all need it, but also I think being socialized within the world that I've been socialized with, and I especially like... We'll always have some version of like immense craving for it, and also some ADHD, which I think leads to that more so as well. All these things. But I can at least find ways to channel the impulse for dopamine into other things. Maybe healthy ways to get dopamine, or healthier ways. Because the thing about addiction in life is, for a lot of us, it's just redirection. It's never like a solution. People need things, like time has to be filled, impulses have to be fed in some way. So it's just about rerouting it into a way that, if possible, benefits you in your life, but at, you know, at the very worst, isn't destructive to you in your life. Now, I would like to go in there and get the little yellow thing, but also I'd like to go get the Mimon that's over here. But we got the Mimon last time. Let's do something different, something new. I'll get the meme on again in my own time. Let's get this. Yippee. A 10,000. Maka. Money, money, money. Money. You know what I'm talking about? Money. Okay. Let's save at the Conan second block. But before we save, let's heal up. I was saying I don't have much to say tonight. Sorry, guys. And that was true, but man, did... Something to say come to me, because I got really startled by that horse in the fucking... What do you call that place? Parking structure, Chronicle Deeds. Aerobus wants me dead. I don't like when people describe opening candy as disrobing it. And you mostly hear it in regards to chocolate. What the hell? In regards to chocolate bars, I'm like, disrobe the chocolate bar. Melt on stove. What is going on here? He's cute. He's really cute. He's elderly. Oh, they're both cute. Wait a minute. The little one's really cute. The big man, now that I look at him, he's hot as fuck. Wait, who? <laughs> nope. Ain't doing it. Absolutely not. Oh, father, please listen to reason. How long are you going to cling to these outdated old traditions? He's crazy because, like, he's got these things that look like legs, but those aren't his legs because his real legs are up fucking doing one of these. And then he's got bracelets. He's got a lot of eyes. All beautiful. Yellow green hair. He's got le 
lime on hair. Like, you know, lime on chips. He's got lime on hair. It's like lemon lime. He's got Sierra Mist hair. Starry. He's got nipples, which is beautiful to see. Makes me very happy. Dark, beautiful skin. Braids. I love a braid on a man's head. Just right against the skull. Don't tell me nothing about a braid against the head. We have to join Spider Legged. I don't know if he's Spider Legged. He only has four legs. Right? No! Ew! Those things around his waist and shoulders are more legs! He a freak. I, I'm obsessed with him. He's like Charlotte's Web if Charlotte's Web was a stud. <laughs> we have to join forces with the other gods. It's smart. You're you a god? Smart thing to do. You're a damn fool is what you are, boy. Throwing away your pride so you can go with the crowd. You, you remember all those years ago? How I wanted to be known as the god of all knowledge of stories? Well, who's going to worship and glorify the names of Anansi and Anyakopan? Now, and just what is that supposed to? Look at his little nose. Nah. You cut it out with that talk. We got company. You're embarrassing us both. Do you mind? We're trying to have a family discussion here. Identify yourself. He's so cool. It's sick how cool he is. I need to read up on his lore, his mythology. Sia. Can't say I've ever heard... Wait, that's a little guy. Sia. Can't say I've ever heard that one. But we're new to these parts ourselves, see? No denying you got a real presence to you. I can tell you're a god who's made a name for himself. I'm gonna... Unfortunately, I wish I wasn't a god. I wish I could just be cool and sleek and slay in the netherworld. I don't want to be a god. In a lot of the preview material for this game, we saw that in this canon of creation, uh, canon of vengeance story that we're playing, sometimes this main character guy and his beautiful blue hair, sometimes he has shorter silver hair. Am I going to have to leave my blue hair phase and enter a short silver hair phase? I'm really just trying to become one with Nahabino. Because that's closer to being one with Algami. So sorry, brother, but we're in the middle of an important... Brother, hey! We're, we're in the middle of an important conversation. Now, come on, father. I want a real answer. You could gain much from standing with Bethel. Please reconsider. Yeah, I'm done talking about it. All them highfalutin gods in Bethel. Fuck Bethel. Gods in Bethel got into their heads that they're the greatest god there is. You want me to just hand over my whole dang mythology to that scheming creator of theirs? Don't do it. Look at the little bird on his staff. Is he African? He looks African. I bet he's African. Don't be stupid. We're supposed to be the kings of all stories. <laughs> king of what land, father? Of what people? We're awfully naked for kings. God fucking, I wish you were awfully naked, king. Sorry, I, do I need to jerk? No, I jerked off when I got home. And this morning. I'm just like this. What'd you say? He's so fucking fine, though, and quirky and cool. And he seems like he's smart. We've lost the faith of many who once worshipped us. They're followers of the God of Law now. We've got to gather more believers, Father. You can't deny we've lost most of our influence anyway. Abdiel said as long as you consent, I can add you to Bethel right away. His only flaw is that he's trying to align with Bethel. One more test then, and if you win this one, join whoever you like. Bethel, Kevel, Schmethel, I don't care. <laughs> now you're talking. My legs itch for a game. It's been a long time since I've competed with my father. <laughs> I didn't say I was doing it. You oh, fuck, do I have to fight him? I'm not ready for a fight. Copa Tengu's not even on the team. Him and Copa Tengu could have a good conversation about cool pants, huh? I know this man named Mark. He's got a big fucking schlong. He's one of the hottest people I've ever met in this life. He worked at the GameStop nearby, and then he stopped, and then... I initially met him because he was... Hanging out downstairs in my house with my roommate, and I said, Fine. <laughs> and, and then he was working at GameStop. Every time I go to GameStop, hi, Mark. And then I would go to the other GameStop on my side of town that Mark didn't work at, and he'd be there 
working and or trading Pokemon cards with the people that worked there. And then he started showing up at my Walmart because he works at the Walmart now. Mark, give me that meat, brother. Give me that meat. I don't know what to tell you. Give me that Finboy meat. I'm so sorry. We have to stop. I didn't say I was doing it. He'll be up against our guests over here. Oh, what? You want me to involve an outsider in this, father? It's an important decision. Anansi, my boy. I'm your father, but I ain't a fool. I know you're a trickster through and through. And so am I. But you know all my tricks by now. Question is, do you know his? I got tricks for you, brother. You, boy. See it. Oh. I forget which one's which. You boy, see ya, right? Yep, I could tell you it's something strange to you the moment I laid eyes on you. Sorry for dragging you into this, but do you think you could teach my fool son a lesson here with this here challenge? Tough love. Tough love. Much obliged. Oh, wait. And how exactly would you have us compete? You two, you two are going on a demon hunt and fuck in Shinagawa. Let's see here. Basilisks are the big chickens. I already saw some in the distance. Oh, I'm not ready to fight. How about hunting down two or more basilisks for me? Whoever hunts more of them wins. If you don't get at least two, you lose. So I have to get at least two, but try to get even more than that. Let's call your time limit how long it takes for a new moon to turn into a full moon. Oh, another one of these! We haven't had one of these puzzles in a minute. While this quest is in progress, increased Mitama spawns granted by downloadable content will be disabled. Are you ready? I would like to swap somebody in real quick. Begin the match. Kill the chickens. <clears throat> you know what? Wait. If they... If they are based in Africa... He's so cool. If they are based in African lore, that's kind of cool. Because a lot of religions there do... Traditionally, like, kill chickens for, like, spiritual religious reasons. So that's... These games are cool. I know they've offended many a people in their time, but it's cool to get these like little hints of lore. And sometimes, you know, it's like misleading to the truth of the lore. There's a little fruit fly, but it is what it is. I need to put Kopatinko on the team now. I don't know what Basilisk is weak to, but Kopatinko, walk to the team. Okay, I gotta go on a chicken hunting spree, baby. Listen. Wait, wait, over here. Oh, it that's the man. No. God! Are you kidding me? Now then, Zia, I have one more thing to say to you. I'd like to give you some information that will help you win this map. Ooh. Why'd they give them nipples? If I'm not allowed to say on the internet that I want to suck them. What are you plotting? Well, I can see why you'd be wary. But you'll want to listen to this. I promise you won't regret it. The truth is, if you won this little challenge, it could actually work out nicely for me, too. Anyway, all you have to do is listen. I'm not saying you have to believe me. Ignore my advice at your leisure. Listen. Remember, carefully, I won't get another chance to tell you with Father keeping an eye on us. Did he mark the chickens for me? I got a map of the local chickens, local chicks in my area. Just head for that exact point and you're bound to win. No question. My goal is to join Bethel, no matter what. All this song and- I'm afraid Bethel's gonna throw- Oh god, he's got a little ponytail with a bead in it? He's like a Jedi if a Jedi was a spider god. Are you kidding me? I need to calm down. Sorry, I'm just horny. I'm not even horny, he's just cool. All this song and dance, it's just a setup for that goal. You're going to undermine your dad, and I don't like that. What I need is for you to hand me a complete and utter defeat, you see. <laughs> well then, until next time. <laughs> I don't want to win now. Um. Okay. Well, fuck. He marked them on my map, but now I can't see them because, like, um, he only marked them once. So I have to go find chickens on my own. Within the moon time. I have to get at least two. This is a nightmare. I don't know where the chickens are anymore. I didn't fucking mentally screen grab what he fucking did. Where's chickens, babe? 
Where's chickens? Daddy needs a new pair of chickens. Cock on the hunt for cock. Um, because you know chickens, cocks, that's roosters. When I say chickens, I think boy and girl chickens. If we're breaking them down, that's hens and roosters, you know? Where's the fucking chicken, brother? I fucking hate this. <laughs> Show me where they are again. What are you up to? I saw a human wearing a hat down, just down the passageway there. He had incredible fire in his eyes like he just made up his mind about something. Cool, I have to find... Ch oh, I can't. That's where the mission is. Don't want to go there right now. I saw chickens and now they're gone. Man, I'm stressed. Give me a minute to be quiet and run around and cry. Oh, we've hit story. Hey, later. Any sign of Atsuda's sister? Hmm. Nothing, huh? Well, I'm gonna look around a little while longer. You mind going to check out that fairy village? Not yet. I'm doing a thing for a dad and a son. Young man. Young man. Ichiro Dazai seems to have changed somewhat since the attack on the school. What do you suppose prompted such a change? He has steeled himself. A stealer. Interesting. So he's become more determined to face the threats instead of running away. Not unlike the saint, after she spoke with Yoko Hiromine, she reflected on her own actions and so found new strength of conviction. She refuses to be stopped by despair. Instead, she views her failures as stepping stones of a kind. Human growth is a remarkable thing. No one actually wants to fail, of course, but it is strange that it can make people stronger. Young man, no matter the despairs you face, know that you will always have my support. And with it, I hope you always rise up stronger than before. Thank you for breaking down the situation for me like a child. Okay, well, I don't want to go there yet. I want to know where the chickens is! Hmm? I'm trying to get clucked. He looks mean. He's on a horse. Good old pummel horse, pummel horse. Where the fuck? Sorry. How many times can I say where the fuck is a chicken? Let me just... Hello? There's at least two. I'd like to save, just in case the worst happens. Who wants it? Of course there's a fucking Mitama in the ring. Get out of here. Do I know what this thing's even weak to? No, because I'm a f idiot. Um... I'm in with that Ruinous Thunder. Oh, wow. Okay, great luck. I'm gonna use this, even though I should've used it on my last turn to maximize the effect, but... Better late than never in this situation. I'm avoiding hitting the Mitama because it's gonna block everything but one type of thing and I don't mind it blocking it other than the fact that it's gonna take away a turn if it blocks it, so I have to be very careful. got this. I'm gonna just hit him with dark. Okay. And then there's another one. I only need to get two, which is nice, but I'd like to get more if possible. We all got poisoned. You're a... That is definitely a rooster, though, huh? I can heal when I'm dead. Not when I'm dead. I can heal after this match, though. We are all dying. <laughs> I 
to see it. Damn it. Just me and Kopatingu at the end. Get Hama on again. Get rid of Bufala again. Okay. More chickens, please. We're also kind of... Ooh. They have died completely. Let's get to that. Oh, no. Let's get to that ley line. <laughs> Let's get to the ley line and heal. Okay. Jeez. Um, heal off. Let's put the people back on the team. Let's put Shitsai on the team. I think he's pretty cool too. And then I really like Yoko being on the team. Being able to end the turn, being able to use an item is very nice to me strategically. Now, let's find more chickens. Look at all those chickens, you know? Except for where are all of those chickens? Yeah, da 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 da. I'm somehow just going in the same circle loop. As if this is the only area in the game suddenly. Oh, hey. Netherworld was born about 20 years ago. Demons make themselves at home, even pop up villages. Yeah, yeah. I hope one day demons can build society. But also, I hope they never do, because society is kind of a blight. Blight, blight, blight. Blight, blight. Oh, the music's back to normal, which makes me think that a full moon has happened, which means I only got two chickens, which is enough. But I always want to be more than enough. Time for the big reveal. Looks like Anansi bagged one basilisks. Sia took down two basilisks. Sia, good hunting out there. You hit the target easy as pie. Well, no hard, no hard feelings, Anansi, but we agreed. No more of this talk about. Hmm. Oh n no, I, I. Oh no, I'm pathetic. I'm so pathetic. Father, I have come to learn my own immaturity, and it pains me so. How could I hope to join Bethel? How, when I am so worthless, so, so incompetent? Wah. Please, please forgive me, Father, please. Anansi. Anansi? Sounds like I'm calling him Anansi, like he's a little Nancy boy, so I gotta be careful. Come on now, dry those tears. Don't worry about joining Bethel, it's fine. Glad that's settled. Err, um, what? I can stop worrying about joining Bethel because you think it's fine. You said it yourself, Father. A fine idea. God dang it! A Nancy, you little- You know he's a trickster! He's a conniving little cunt! You probably taught him his ways. Thank you so much, Father. With your words and my- Silver Tongue! We're talking Silver Tongue again! It's always Silver Tongue, Silver Tongue, Silver Tongue up in this piece. It's a lot of groin, it's a lot of Silver Tongue in the Netherworld. With your words in my silver tongue, I'm sure Abdia will be happy to welcome us. After all, I am the king of all stories, and I'm quite good at telling them. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be back with an offer letter from Bethel. Come on out. Yum, yum, yum. Stop that rascal, Anansi. Those little dragon guys. What? Don't kill him. Please don't kill him. I love him. Daddy, no. Anansi, I already told you. I'm your father. You think I don't know what kind of malarkey you'd try to pull? Whatever it is you're planning, I can guess it all. You damn stubborn old man. Yami Yami, take Anansi away. I'm gonna tie you up good where no one can get to you. Shit, let me get... Never mind. Yeah, that boy of mine could be a real pain in the keister. Sorry for all the mess here, but I've got my little helpers rounded up thanks to you distracted him. 
Thanks for playing around with us. Here's a little gift. I got Virtuous Order Preapt. Alright. Um, Restore. Nah, Agility. Who needs it? You know what I'm talking about? Let's go Magic. Nah, let's go Strength. I don't give a fuck about Seal. Unless it's the fucking... What's that song? Kiss from a Rose. Then I care deeply about Seal. Kiss from a Rose is a great song. And I hate old music, but god damn. Kiss from a Rose. Baby. You know? And hey, you're a pretty slick hunter yourself. He quite likes me, doesn't he? The Nyami Nyami have been watching you hunt. I think you really want him over. They asked me to give you this here to you. Shock drop. Oh, first time I've seen anyone hunt. First time I've seen anyone with hunting skills like that. Ain't hunting basilisks a nice change of pace for you? I might as well set it up so you can go hunting again anytime you like. If you're interested, come talk to my. No, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. He told me to ski daddle. I love the word ski daddle. Okay. Now, I would still like to get to that abscess today. I have no idea where it is. I am truly and deeply turned around. I want to fucking know who's got a side quest for me. A woman. Hey there, tall, dark, and handsome. I'm Succubus. Got a moment to talk? You didn't meet a demon named Kamdhanda on your way here, did you? I don't think so, but I recognize that name. Um, Honda and I, we used to be close. We were both, well, dark horses in our own separate ways. But the guy's been through a lot. Now he's back to being how he used to be, a senseless, violent ogre. Before his relapse, oh my god. He'd even got himself a place at the side of a guardian deity. He was like one of the best in that circle, totally respected. So I kind of need your help with Kumahanda. Performing his rights, I guess. I want you to put him out of his misery. It's gotten to a point where I don't think even he remembers who he is anymore. Oh, you know what? Kumhanda might be the horse that I said was a robust. I think Kumhanda is the horse with the groin in the hat. He has like a Philip Tracy hat. His pelvis is out. And he's fast as fuck. Um, it's a selfish request, if that wasn't clear. Don't like seeing Kumhanda like this. The guy I knew wasn't some mindless monster. I mean, I'm eager to kill him. I don't like that, man. Well, I'll be counting on you. It's a lot of reading today. I would like to do a lot of abscess. One time I had an abscess tooth, and I think I still do. Have we talked about this? Probably many, many times. In many, many different ways. Somebody's up there that wants to talk to me. Okay, <laughs> I don't know why I become the fucking... What's what's the thing that's... Yeah, but, 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 what's that thing? You know what I'm talking about? There's a character from an old... I don't even want to talk about it anymore. Where's the thing? I'm going to mark it because I keep getting turned around. But how do I get there exactly? It's a question of its own. Oh, no, I'm not going to look at the map forever. It's not going to solve itself. Now, I've been up here. And what did it get me? Excuse me, little guys. We need him to fight. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Let's go get that meme on now that we're up here again. I can ever remember where the fuck anybody is at. There's the abscess too. Let's save before we get to the abscess. Wouldn't that be cool? Oh, 
Oh, we already went to this. It killed us once. I already forgot that we did that, and I already forgot what exactly is contained within the abscess. Like, what enemies it is. Fuck. Can we not do this right before I have a fight? Okay, cool. I've got to go. I am going to be cheap and do that a lot in this. Oh, wait, let me do this. And do that a lot in this game with the smoke. You would think I would reschedule my lights to stop doing this at 10 in the PM. Now, do y'all remember what he's weak to? Did we ever find out? One moment. Okay. Let me just go ahead with the fucking... Oh, they were weak to force, weren't they? Or light? Because they were dark-sided? It was light. They were weak to light. We just made the big mistake of not... <laughs> healing last time. Um... Should've used the critical thing, but I didn't, and we'll survive. You don't have a light attack because you're a dark sided girl. Said it before, I'll say it again. She's like, if Shadow the Hedgehog. Let's go for a gym. Was a girl. Should I use a dark dampener since I remember that they use a dark move? Yeah. I don't think it's gonna be like a particularly hard fight, but. Let me not underestimate this game at any point. Because to underestimate the game. Oh! I fucked up, I did not need a dark dampener. To underestimate the game is to overestimate myself. And we've already been over this. This game can sniff hubris. Every Mega Ten game can fucking smell hubris. It stinks. It stinks like a gamer. Should use the Magatsuhi thing again. I have to use somebody's turn to heal. Oh, Yoko's not gonna get a name, so a, a turn, so I have to heal with Sia's turn. Woo, that was close. Um, who needs healing a little bit to everybody? It's really only a little bit, a little bit indeed. I hope nobody dies. <laughs> I hope nobody dies. Um, oh, that's nice. Okay, that does a sin. Okay. Now, what do we think they're gonna do with that Magatsuri? Should I use a spyglass and find out? I don't know. We'll have to see. I could just try to kill him. One of these days, this game's gonna let my demons use items, and it's gonna be game over for the game. There's only one of them now, so like, what what damage is he gonna do with one turn, you know? 
Well, she's in like a different skill than usual. Deal the final blue, Shetsai. Oh, we need to go talk to that rabbit, too. I'd like to do that today. Cleared the abscess. We don't need to go to the fairy village yet. Ichiro does, I said. Come on, Vamanos. Everybody's in the forest. Come on, Vamanos. I said, no, sir. I have to go show a rabbit another demon of the Orient. Okay. Old World's Blessing is one of these things. When do my demons get to use items, though? That's my number one question. Now, we only got three people in our party. Let's fix that. Tao? Yoko needs it. Oh, wait. Yoko's, Yoko's healed up. How did that happen? I don't know. Sorry, Tao. Okay. Okie dokers. Now, let's find that rabbit, right? Now... I think it's this one. Do y'all think it's... Do y'all think it's this one? Or was it before that? I think it was before that. This was all of this, and then yup, 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 yup. Bear with me here. It could be this one. That's the one I was just talking about. I've decided it's this one. The quickest way to get there is gonna be this. I feel like they could have made the this screen less cluttered so as to make and more zoomed in so I could better understand where I was landing when I did this but there he is I got it right brother I've got you another demon of the orient oh he doesn't know puncture punch when do you learn puncture punch at what level I want to know more about you. What is going on? He learns it up and up. You know what? Watch this shit. I'm not fucking around. Oh, hey. Okay. Um. Okay, now he's got puncture punch. Which does what? Medium physical to one foe ignores affinity resistance and pierces through. Piercing's always nice to have. I'll get rid of this one. Now do you care about my demon of the Orient? Hey, mister, did you bring a Shetsai who can use pun puncture punch? Let Shetsai meet the hair of Anaba. Yeah, now he better not try to eat him again. Leave that little rabbit alone. You told Hair that you brought Shetsai. Woohoo! Then call out Shetsai right now. Just a reminder that this little plinky plunky baby song is kind of fun. It's really nice. I really do quite like that. Get that volume right. Okay. 
Hey. Oh, hey, I came out because I heard there was a babe here. So what the hell's with this rabbit? I didn't hear shit about this. Leave him alone, he's a baby. Wow, it actually did puncture punch. So cool. I'm Harvey Naba. Your horn's super awesome. What's that? You actually get how great my horn is, eh? <laughs> you ain't too bad, kid. Maybe I should let you join my flock or something. Whoa, for real? I would, but you ain't got any horns or fangs, do you? Then I ain't got shit to teach you. No way. Sorry, kid, but there's things even demons can't do. Maybe it's better if you hop on back to the countryside and dig up carrots instead. That feels racist for some reason. I don't know why telling the ki the rabbit to go back to the countryside and dig up carrots. It's like, can't he be different than what you expect him to be? Seems more, seems more your speed. This rabbit is getting red, threatened. Every time. Oh, his little ears are down, baby. Oh, mister, you're still here? Oh, right. Thanks for bringing Shetsa here to meet me. I hope one day this rabbit wins. I got an Uma talisman. Loved her in Kill Bill. Okay. What'd you get? Force block? Oh, that's one from earlier. We do want that. He doesn't need to heal. Aww. The lower the HP of all allies, the more damage and HP recovered through skills for one turn. That's pretty cool. See ya. Maybe I'm a fool for thinking... For having positive ambitions with a Megaton game. But, um, I believe that that rabbit's gonna have a happy ending at a, some point in this game. Is that crazy? Because these games are like... Uh, they're punishing and they're like suffocating and they are like... There are a lot of things negative. But I do think they hold some version of hope. And I think any world with even a shred of hope is a safe place for a rabbit to dream. Yeah, and I've always said that. What are y'all doing down there? Somebody wants to talk to me, and I don't know if they're down there. I don't know if they're right there. I don't even know how to start getting up there. did it who is it a child a golden child of the harvest oh. I have soda is that part of the harvest <laughs> I'm oh Harvey look at that goddess of the harvest Demeter Demeter I don't know a lot about lore so I don't know if Demeter has to be an adult woman Every time I've seen Demeter, god damn is she she's been a woman and a half. This today she's just a half. I'm the goddess of the harvest, Demeter. Right now, Tokyo is a barren wasteland, but one day I shall turn it into a verdant land of harvest in abundance. When the time comes, I would like to know what that I may call upon you. You're very cute. Now, can I get over there? Yes, I can. Can I get a yippee? Let me get this first. You know what? Can I get back up there? Got Elagor's essence. Um, fuck. Man. How does a man get back where he was? Ain't that the fucking question in life? But also, you don't want to get back to where you were in life. You want to move forward to something different. Life doesn't get worse, it just becomes different. And once you understand that... Every time I say some shit like that, I know somebody's gonna come at me with some extenuating circumstances. Like, well, I used to, you know, be safe and do well, and now I'm getting raped every day and I have no food. And I'm like... You know, that really does, like, challenge my 
fucking overwhelmingly positive, optimistic like outlook in the world. And those things I say were like, life doesn't get worse, only like equal but different. And like, I don't know, I need to kind of like meditate on them. So I don't exactly know what I think about those types of circumstances. Because it's not enough to shake my belief in what I say. But also, is that not a worse life that came from change? So, I'll do that off camera. I don't think men need to become better men in front of others. I think we go into our little man cocoon. People always talk about man cave, man cave, man cave. Y'all men need to get a cocoon. Stop watching sports in the garage. Grow up. Get a cocoon. Get a man cocoon. I don't know exactly what yours looks like. Mine is baths in the dark in, or in dim red light with the Xenoblade soundtrack playing. There's a video on YouTube called Xenoblade songs to relax to after a long day or something. You listen to that in a hot bath with Epstein salts, dim red lights. You close your eyes, you float, you meditate, you become a better man. And I will meditate on like my optimism. Because, like, I don't want to be harmful with it. I don't want to, you know... Visit Fairy Village already? Go between buildings and uphill south of here. Follow the path. Do you guys want to get there today? I mean, what time is it? It's not that late. I could get there today. I ain't got nowhere to be except for in bed playing Animal Crossing. God damn it! So, I'm still very early in Animal Crossing, so I can't do Night Owl Ordinance. And I'm also so early in Animal Crossing that... Oh, hello, Ichiro Dazai. Every day fucking matters. Like, what I get done right now matters so I can progress. Like, I have to build houses for the three new villagers. That's who I'm, like, that's where I'm at. I haven't built a single one of those homes. Um, so when I don't play until late in the day, it's like I missed my fucking chance to go to the store and to do a few things, but... That's life. Now, Ichiro, my love. I've decided I'm going to use what I've learned to save everyone who was taken. So let me handle this. I'll keep up the search on this end. I'm gonna keep looking around over here. I'll let you handle the fairy village. I usually have the voices turned up way over the odd, like the rest of the sounds. That sounded like he was quiet. Did my shit get fucked? My shit got fucked. One second. Sound effects down. Background volume down. Ambient noise, down. Voice is up. What the hell? Hopefully the music wasn't too loud. How'd they erase my set? What he said? I've decided I'm going to use what I've learned to save everyone who was taken. So let me handle this. I'll keep up. I'm going to keep looking around over here. Okay, so I don't go there yet. The Mimon told me how to get to the fairy village. I just don't remember what he said. Do you think it's past that horse? Somebody wants to talk to me over there. Do you think it's the horse that wants to- Hello, Bicorn. Of the horses in this game, you're the one I least want to pummel, probably. Beyond this mountain is a place filled with trees. That's where we need to go. Fairies live in hiding there. Thank you for the facts, horse of facts. He's a gift horse. Don't stare him in the mouth. And his gift is knowledge. And his mouth has teeth. Most horses have teeth. Do you think a horse has ever been born without teeth? I do. Is that that bald bitch? If we're gonna fight her because I wanna try to like <laughs> enslave her. <laughs> Not enslave, but you know what I mean? Or did we already make one? I think she's fusible to us. But you know what's easier than fusing? Enslavement. But not enslavement, because I'm, like, talking to her. Convincing. I love convincing women. Hello, ma'am. She looks so peaceful. Hello, Deese. This love has taken its toll on me. I know somebody that listens to Maroon 5 on purpose, and, it, like, I don't ever want to be mean or, like... All art is good art. Point blank, period. Mean it, believe it. I'm listening to Maroon 5 on purpose. Why don't I read your palm? Here, give me your hand. Uh. 
Give me your hand, ma'am. I'm not just going to hold my hand out for you. I can give you a good slap in the face, though. Ah. I'm gonna try that again if they don't all kill us. Resisting physical moves is pretty fucking slay. They got Magatsuhi. We might die here, but if I die trying to talk to a woman, then so fucking be it. What? Oh! My comma something smells. She's not saying my something smells. She's saying my something smells. I thought she was saying my something smells. And I said, ma'am, you are more elegant than that. My something smells. It's a conspiracy. Yes. So you sense it too. Yes, we're being watched. Let's stage a fight to avoid suspicion. She's clever. Apologies in advance if this kills you. She's. I used to be so good at talking to demons. Look at my first playthrough of this game. Don't. Ooh, we're dying. We better do it right this time because I'm going to go talk to her. Um. Oh, they got turns. My first playthrough of this game, I was great at talking to fucking demons, but nowadays I'm fucking, I don't really do it all that often, but I also suck at it now. I, um. What, just looking isn't enough? You can touch if you want. touch my aren't you brave i guess now you'll have to pay i think i'll be taking that naughty little hand not my naughty little hand ma'am you invited mm, no means no consent can be revoked oh man this is the end damask oh i'm alive i'm alive i'm alive you remember that song fucking I can feel you all around me. Remember that one? Um, I bet I can do something crazy. Let's fucking fully heal fucking Nahabino if possible. I'm gonna hold on to that. I'm gonna go Ox Bazaar. Ox Bazongas. Okay, and then let's hope that this hits somebody's weakness. Nope, I'm just trying to get me an extra turn, y'all. I'm gonna talk again in a second. I will not be stopped from talking to a woman. She's a tough nut to crack though, her and that bald head. Her brain is close to being exposed, no hair covering it up, but still I cannot see her mind. So, what business did you have with me? She doesn't like when I flirt with her. Which sucks. Let's talk. Thanks. So you want to talk, hmm? Then I'm sure you'll know what you need to give me. A drink? Yes. I suppose that'll do. A little chat is always better if there's drinks involved. So, what are you gonna give me? Alcohol. Yes. Well then, don't mind if I do. Hmm. <laughs> How'd she get that drunk that fast that she's hiccuping? My, don't you have any thin to go with this, do you? <laughs> I don't care why. Just give me something. <laughs> she becomes like a different person when she drinks. Let me see. I had like 2,612 maka. That's a very specific number. You're paying a debt. What does this do? Does it let me win the transaction? I'll just give her the money. She's pretty, even if she, like, beats me off after this, I'll still be happy to have given her my money. Okay, I'd like one dark dampener. Can I buy more of those? Very well. She's gonna think I'm a cuck for giving in too much. Now, two life stones you've gone too far. You've had enough. Yes. Oh, so you caught me. I am Dees. A pleasure. I got Dees. These nuts. Love her. 
God, what a difficult fucking fight that was. Welcome to the team, girly, girly pop, girly pop, bald head, bald head. Who else wants to be on the team right now? You know what? Rikshasha, you low-leveled freak. No, we'll do Shiki Ouija. Okay. Let's save so I don't lose Dees. And let's trudge forward into the fairy village. It will close out the video in the fairy village, but first... God, get out of my way. We must get there. Please, God, don't kill me, chicken. I know there's a Mimon over here. I just know it. I can smell Mimon. They smell wretched. Where's a Mimon? Mimon. Really no Mimon over here? Well, then what do I smell? If not Mimon. Huh. All right. This better not be a fight, little bro. I like his optimistic spin. He says, good luck. Adventuring is overcoming danger. Launches me into a battle. What do you got? Interesting. You have interesting moves. Anybody got a force attack? <laughs> No, absolutely not. Okay, um... Let me finish my juice. Oh, that's a shocker, but this is what adventuring is all about, right? Why is my Nahabino, like, twitching? Do you see him? He's glitching out. He's tweaking. Man, I would love to tweak with Nahabino. Like, I'm a, not a tweaker these days in the way I once was, but Nahabino and I, actually, I wouldn't let him. I would kiss him on the forehead and say, baby, stop. Stop it. Are you not having fun in your life the way it is? Why are we pushing our bodies to such a point? In search of joy? You think joy comes from an exhaustion of the wellness of the body? How foolish you must be, Nahabino. I would say that and then he would be fixed. It's that easy to fix a man, really. In case you didn't know, now it is beautiful up in here. You know what? We're going to save right here, right on this cliff. Real Breath of the Wild moment. Da, 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 you know? But, oh. They want me to jump down there. I'm going to go ahead and save. This is where we are. Me, you, and Agatheon. Thank you for hanging out. I'll see you next time. We should go kill that man in the parking garage with the groin. So you can see him. And also so that that woman can live a peaceful, happy life. Maybe next time. Maybe off camera. I don't know. Thanks for hanging out.